Regarding the campus at Michigan State University, it, it was Michigan State College then, and it was a very prominent part of our city life because it was a great university close by, and I wandered on that campus like it was a neighborhood park. In fact, I think that's one of the ways in which I discovered landscape architecture because I was intrigued with this one World War II building that was still being used for classrooms. It was a kind of a Quonset hut. It's where the landscape architecture urban planning program occurred. And I remember walking through, and I'm about 15, 14, walking through that building and seeing these phenomenal drawings and plans and beautifully rendered sketches. And I was so thrilled with that. I had been already interested in art, but this kind of art was different for me. It was art to solve problems. And in that my father was an engineer, and I was picking up some of those vibes of engineering. It was problem solving supreme for me. That was really a cool idea of using art, not for art's sake, but art to help discover and solve a problem.